Hey there, TRW crew. Matt Vassallo here with the rhinestoneworld.com. So we had a question on the Facebook page the other night as far as how to create one of our life begins when the season starts designs that we have in rhinestones, but they want to do it just as a vector file to be able to do a heat transfer vinyl. I'm going to show you how easy that is. So we have a set of our baseball laces here that we have available at the rhinestoneworld.com. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to type out life. And I'm going to use the impact font. I'm going to tighten the spacing up on that font right here with my text spacing. Let's widen it out a little bit. And I'm going to get it to about 9.7 inches, somewhere in that range. I'm going to grab my laces, bring those to the front. And we're just going to arrange the laces in here so they're going throughout the entire design there. That looks nice. So that looks perfect there. And I want it a little bit near the bottom, a little bit near the top. So that looks pretty good. I can even shrink it down a little bit if I want to. I just don't want it overlapping. And I'm going to show you two different versions of this, okay? So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Place and Fill. And I'm going to do one island to the outside at 0 .09. Do a little island fill on that. So you'll see what that gave me there. And then I'm going to give you guys a choice of which one you think you like better. And just comment below on which one you like better, the top one or the bottom one. So I'm going to click on my red, shift click to my black, and I'm going to hit intersect. So intersect buttons right there. And I can delete my red. Then I'm going to go white, shift click to the back, and I'm going to do back minus front. I can change these laces to red. And there's our life part. Or I could also do it this way if I went... With the red right here, I could keep that all red. So I could just go to the outline, click there, and do back minus front. So the laces are going all the way through the entire design. So two different options there of what we want to do. It's still very easy to read where it says life. And we'll go ahead and add the begins when the season starts. So I'm just going to go to right here. I'm going to go life and then begins when the... And I'm going to use that same impact font. So I'm going to go to my fonts and impact font. Let's enlarge that along there and space it there perfectly. That looks good there. Duplicate that down. And I'm going to go ahead and center it. And I'm going to edit my text. So to edit text, I can just click on my text right there. And life begins when the season starts and hit OK. And I can enlarge that out, make it a little bit bigger so it fits nicely right below it. And there we go. And change that to my black. So you can see there's our life begins when the season starts. I can duplicate this one over here so we can see both of them at the same time. And then you guys can let me know which one you think looks better. So Two different versions here with the laces going all the way through or the laces cut off in the different letters. Honestly, I think both of them look pretty good. I can't really decide. So you let me know. Do you like the top one better where the laces are cut off? Or do you like the bottom one better where the laces are going all the way through? With me looking at it, I'm going to go with the top one. Okay, so a little bit easier to read the life. So I'm going to go with the top one. Let's go ahead and delete that. I'm going to click on all of my black areas right there. So I have all of them selected. I just shift click to them and I'm going to weld all those together. I have my reds already good. So I can go to the TRW Stone Wizard. I can go to my mockups. Let's do my magic vinyl first if I wanted to use black glitter and red glitter. So I got, oh, sorry, the black glitter there and my red glitter there for the laces. So there's that design. Or I could use a silver glitter or even a white glitter, highlight my design. I'm 9.7 inches. Cool thing about this is we can change the size to whatever we want since it's an all vector file. Now I can go over to my mockups and I can say I want this to go on a black tank top. So I can go front design, click on this tank top right here. It's going to run through it real quickly for me. Drop it there perfectly onto the tank top. I'm going to switch my background color to a light gray and change my tank top to a black tank top. And you can see how awesome that design looks in the glitter vinyl, completely done. Best part about it, if I went back to page one, check this out. Let's shrink this down to a car decal size, about four and a half by six, somewhere in that range. And watch this. Let's go to my accessories. Click right here on the car window. 
it's going to run through. I can use my FDC glitter sign vinyl and check out how awesome that looks. Now life begins when the season starts as a car decal. So in a matter of a couple minutes, we created this design from scratch with the TRW Stone Wizard and Corel Draw, but also made a shirt design and a car decal design and made a mock-up of each of them to be able to send to the customer. So hope this video helped you out. Again, comment below. Let us know which one you liked better. Let us know what you think of this video, if it helps you out when you're designing, because that's our goal is obviously to teach you as much about the software as we can so you can create all these awesome custom designs and you can grow your business. So if you do have any questions, make sure to give us a call. Number is 941 This is Matt with the rhinestoneworld.com and you guys all have a great day.